you hearing me? Amen. I mean it. Look at somebody say, it's going to happen tonight. <laughs> and look at somebody say, it ain't got nothing to do with the preacher. <laughs> look at somebody say, it's all about Jesus. <laughs> Listen to me carefully. See, really, each testimony should make you turn your eyes toward Jesus. Come on now. See, the purpose of the word is to get you to see Jesus, hear Jesus, surrender to Jesus, yield to Jesus, give your life to Jesus, uh, exchange your life for his life. See, I know you think this is a healing service. Look at somebody say, but this service is all about Jesus. That's the one to say, I knew I turned it off. <laughs> now, to be effective, here's what I need to have you do. Now, you have to follow my instructions, please. Everybody listen to me. When you testify, it's real, it's real simple. I don't want you to tell us your life story. <laughs> Come on, Dad. I, I, I know, I know, but... You know, what I need, though, is I need you to say, say your first name, what your condition was. Don't tell us about, you know, if you had a surgery, just say, I had surgery. This was my problem. This is how it affected me. This is how long I had it. And this is what Jesus did for me. Amen. Is everybody clear? Yes. My name, the problem, how long I had it, and what Jesus did for you. Now look at somebody said the message has already started. Now listen to me. I want you to release your faith toward God as you hear each testimony. Because God is in a good mood. Look at somebody say, do you know how you got saved? Look at him say, because God was in a good mood. Can I ask you a question? I'm going to let you testify. How many of you used to drink, but Jesus has delivered you and you don't drink no more? Stand to your feet. Now stand up. I'll get that. Do you want to know why you don't drink no more? Because Jesus was in a good mood. You got a problem, and I want to tell you what it is. <laughs> Look at him and say, you done half forgot where Jesus brought you from. I want everybody standing, lift up your hands and start praising God because of what he did for you. Come on, praise him. Praise him. Praise him. You are here because you are on the Jesus, be the miracle. He's doing a miracle. Every day you see this over, you walk on it. The miracle power of Jesus Christ. Now listen to me. Why you remain standing? Do you know why you delivered from alcohol? Because of somebody's test. Come on now. You heard the word about what Jesus did for somebody else, and you said, that's for me. See, I'm going to make me preach up in there. They're going to make me go someplace. <laughs> have a sit down. No, no, no. I'm, I'm, I, I got to go ahead and have a sit down. I got to go here. Because, see, I'm going to show you. See, I'm going to. What's happening right now is we're, we're, we're moving. Starting to move into the glory realm. Amen. Okay? Watch this. I'm going to show you this. I'm going to show you this. Because when you begin to testify to Jesus, something happens to the atmosphere. Now, I'm going to show you. 
How many of you used to be on drugs, but Jesus doesn't deliver you? Stand to your feet. Look at somebody and say, worship God. Look at somebody and say, with the revelation of the word that release you from drug addiction. Look at somebody say, it was the testimony of Jesus that set you free. Now you need to praise God for your deliverance. Now you can take your seat. You want to know why? Listen. If God can deliver you from alcohol, if God can deliver you from drugs, God can heal your body. Now I'm going to let you testify. First, and now, get ready. I'll tell you, I feel it. Oh, I feel it. I, I feel it already. Oh, my God. Me too. I feel it. I feel it. So, what's your name? Sister Priscilla. And, and what was your condition? I had a crooked spine, arthritis. I couldn't walk right. And I was in a lot of pain for seven years. And Jesus healed you this morning? Yes. And where did you have pain and where did it disappear? I had pain from my feet all the way up to my hips, to my back, to my top shoulders. And Pastor here said, okay, we're going to heal you. Leave my name out. Okay, John said, we're going to heal you. He touched me. Jesus touched forgive anybody? Don't call no names. No. You was good. I was good. Praise the Lord. <laughs> Pastor took me to spend time with the fellas. And so, uh, I want you to tell them first name. Name's Bill. And what were your physical conditions? How long had you had them? Well, the one that you mentioned to me that I didn't tell you was back. But uh, what I did tell you was the, uh, the beating I took with a metal pipe about 12 times upside the head was uh, uh, headache and uh, memory loss. And, and you were in pain? Oh, yes. And God healed you? God, Jesus healed me. Yeah. He healed me. Somebody ought to give God a I don't care if you had migraine headache. I don't care if you had arthritis. I don't care if you have, have been, uh, uh, you haven't been able to move. God can heal you and he wants to. You can go and praise him. You know what I think I'll go, man, woman, man, woman. Come. Amen. Now listen, here's what's wild. You know, we had a lot.